Hello viewers and subscribers and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we will learn how we can have this animated cursor in our WordPress website. And not only this type of cursor, we will learn how we can have a variety of uh, custom cursors in our WordPress website and absolutely free. Okay, so this plugin which we will be going to use to design this cursor, animated cursor will be absolutely free. Let us take a look at codecanon.net and here you can see that WP custom cursors is of $20. And if we review this item, you will get an idea that what type of custom cursors are available there in the market. So as you can see that this is cursor 1, 2, 3, 4 and as you can see that there are varieties of custom cursors available and they are all together 18 in number. So we had seen that what are custom cursors are and what are the different types of custom cursors available. Now we will learn how we can add to our WordPress website. So if any of you guys who don't have a WordPress website yet, you can have it in just three easy steps. First is you have to get a hosting and a domain of which I had provided a link in my description box from where you can get a affordable and really fast WordPress hosting and with a free domain. Uh, and after that, once you have a hosting and a domain, you have to install WordPress on that and it's super easy to do that. You can do that with just a click. After that, once you had a hosting and domain and you had installed WordPress on your hosting, then you have to make a WordPress website of which a lot of tutorials are available there on our channel or other channels as well. So you can learn from there. So let us go to our dashboard and see how to do this. So this is my WordPress dashboard and it will be same as mine when you open your dashboard as well. So at the left hand side you will see this option called plugins and here hover on that and then click on add new button. So Once you will click that add new button, this screen will appear right in front of you. And at the top right corner, you can see the search plugin option. Here, you have to type WP Custom Cursors. I think the internet is disconnected. Uh, wait, let me fix that. Okay, so these are the results of our search. As you can see, there are three types of WP custom cursors plugins available, but we will choose this WP custom cursors by WebTrendy. So click on install now. I had tried all the three types that are uh, available, but I will tell you that this WP mouse custom cursor, it doesn't work in the latest version of WordPress and this ultimate custom cursor, it doesn't give you a variety of custom cursors and the uh, options to change like the color and the uh, width of the custom cursor and things like that. But WP custom cursors give you a variety of uh, different custom cursors as well as a lot of options to customize your cursor. Once you have installed it, then click on activate. Okay, so once you have activated it, then in the installed plugin section, you can see WP custom cursors and uh, at the left hand side where you get all the different options of WordPress, you can see this WP custom cursors. So click on WP custom cursors. And here you will get uh, an option uh, to add a new cursor. Click on this add new cursor. Now you will get this type of a screen. So here you can select the uh, shape. Here image cursor is also available but only in the pro version. In the free version, you can still have a lot more options like shape 1, 2. For example, if we select shape 3 here, you can see the preview. It's shape 3 and shape 4 and my favorite shape 11. And if you further scroll down, you can see the option to change the color. Here you can select the color you want. Okay. So now it's blue. And let us select this. Okay. Uh, okay, so red color. Okay, so now it's red. Uh, a variant of red. And 
if you further scroll down you can see the width option so from here you can select the width as you can see uh, it's of this size but if you type 50 in it you can see the width of the cursor is increased i will suggest that keep it between 30 to 40 so let me keep it 40 and as you can see now it's just fine so after you had designed a cursor uh, let me show you uh, you have some more options like hover effect uh, so you can also select some hover effect from here and uh, show default cursor uh, you can also select for example if you select this show default cursor then this cursor as you can see white cursor will also appear with the animated cursor but i will recommend you to turn it off so that uh, when any visitor will come to your website he can just play around with the cursor and it is very beneficial if you want a uh, good uh, retention of visitors on your website because they like it when they visit they play with the cursor and hence they spend more time on your blog or on your website so once you had done all this uh, click on save cursor now you can check your website and as you can see we had this animated cursor okay so we have this animated cursor so i hope you have learned that how you can have the animated cursor on your WordPress website. Okay, so if you have any query regarding this video, you can just write down in the comment section or you can message me on Instagram. I hope you had enjoyed this video. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.